So among the patients we are seeing today in post-op, this is Jerry. He, have, he was sent to me, referred to me with the post-traumatic dilated pupil, subluxated dense cataract, stigmatism about seven after the regular stigmatism with keratoconus. And uh, in this case, the question became, what are we going to do for him? Again, as you know my style, just doing surgical acrobatics is not my goal. It's how to make them see the best you can with the least surgical intervention, keeping elegance in your way. So what we planned in this case, you can still see the iris transilluminations here. And you can see the pupil is still dilated and abnormal from trauma. But what I planned here is I was able to remove his cataract and fixate a lens and put it in a perfect plane at the same time, make my capsular excess so small that it kind of blocks the light coming in. And with this concept, we corrected not only his refractive error, because here you are in his pre-op. His cataract was not only dense, it was also subluxated, meaning it was tilted due to lack of support on one side from the trauma that caused it. The cornea is keratoconus with high keratometry and high astigmatism. The pupil is very dilated with transillumination defects, again, from the trauma and very high farsightedness. So when you look at this scenario, what we planned for him was, I made a small opening in his capsular bag. So that opening with the remaining capsule, which I did not clean, becomes an opaque barrier, like a pupil itself, decreasing the lights coming in. Leaving his pupil where it is, that if in the future we need, we can still do pupiloplasty. But in this case, we left it open to first see how he does. And luckily, this was a non-dominant eye. So using a technology, we were able to do the lens exchange surgery in order to cancel all the refractive errors, at the same time fixate the lens and get his vision to 2020, despite the anatomy. And here we have Jerry back here, uh, years later after his surgery post-op. Jerry, how do you feel with that eye? Feel good. I see a lot better, and thanks to you, I have good vision. It's my pleasure. How do you drive at night, Jerry? Good, no problem. Wonderful. Any glasses at all? No. Perfect. And again, I just want to share this with the doctors that please, elegance of surgery, minimalistic is where artistry is. Anybody can do invasive surgery, but minimalistic, but visually oriented. And you'll be surprised how you can bring your patients to excellent vision. And hence, I always show my patients because it's important. That's the only mark of success and accountability. Jerry, it's been a pleasure again seeing you. Thank Enjoy you. that. Take care.